John 14, 21 Those who accept my commandments and obey them are the ones who love me. Please join us in prayer in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for who you are and all the blessings you've given us in our lives, especially the blessings that go unnoticed. We humbly ask you, Lord, to help us be obedient to your will, to your words, to your commands, and to all the inspirations you put in our hearts. Lord, you know that sometimes we tend to do our own thing and we sway away from the path that you've set for us. But we also know, Lord, that you are merciful and that you will always do everything you can to get us back on track. So please, Heavenly Father, give us the ability to stay obedient, to stay humble, and to pursue you over everything. Please help us love you the way that you deserve to be loved. Please help us know more about how much you really love us. We know, Lord, that when we understand the fullness of your love, we won't just try, we will not try to just obey your commands out of duty, but we will start obeying your commands out of love because we don't want to hurt you. Please help us grow in childlike faith, trust, and love. So that way, when we reach the end of our lives, you'll be able to say, Well done, my good and faithful servant. We thank you for everything, Lord, and we praise you. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Good evening. Welcome to our day 55 for our coronavirus prayer novena. And today we want to dedicate our prayers actually to my, my friend's uncle. Uh, unfortunately, he passed today. And um, his name is Bartholomew Kin Hyun Tran. So we want to dedicate it to his soul that it may rest in peace and that all of his family members will find comfort and hopefully will find Jesus' love during uh, these really, really, really tough times. Now, today we wanted to choose a word that was based on the readings at Mass. So our word for today is obey. In John 14, 21, Jesus said to those who... Um, Jesus said to his disciples that those who accept my commandments and obey them are the ones who love me. So if I were to think about that, I would always wonder what that means. So that's why in our word obey, it, it's broken down to offer your heart, beg for humility, enlighten your mind, and yield to his mercy. So to offer our heart to the Lord, it's, it's a sort of a self-surrender where we offer our, our goals, our identity, our passions, our desires. It's an offering of ourself to Him. In order for us to be obedient, we have to really learn how to put our pride down and allow ourselves to be humble. So humility is a gift. It, you're not necessarily born with it. And so that's why the next word is beg for humility. It's a gift from God to be humble, and many times humility is developed. So we want to ask God for, for humility and to increase that virtue in us. Next is enlighten your mind. It's really hard to obey someone you don't know. It's even harder to obey someone you don't love. So. We encourage you to enlighten your mind to really understand who Jesus is, really understand his love, his mercy, really understand your identity in Christ. Because when you have wisdom and when you have understanding, it's, it's so much easier to obey. And the last word is why, which is yield to his mercy. Once, we, once we're in obedience with God, we are, we are victims to his mercy. We want to allow ourselves to really accept his forgiveness, accept his love, and receive it. Once we lay it all out right before him in front of the cross, 
We want to receive the mercy he is waiting to give us. And we also want to forgive ourselves. So with that, we want to go, we're going to go ahead and start our prayers. And my dad will go ahead and lead us in our rosary of peace. Hello, good evening. And we are about to start with our uh, prayer for tonight. And uh, let's offer our heart to the Sacred Heart of Jesus and the Immaculate, Immaculate Heart of Mary. Beg for their humility and uh, ask for mercy that our prayers will be answered. That's why we have the uh, twin hearts, Heart of Jesus and the Heart of Mary. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and the third day He rose again. He ascended into heaven and seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour for death amen glory be to the father to the son to the holy spirit as it was the beginnings now it shall be world without end amen our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was the beginnings, now ever shall be world without end amen our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not to temptation but deliver us from evil amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was the beginnings, now it shall be, world without end. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit as it was the beginnings, now it shall be, world without end. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour for death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was the beginning, is now ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and the hour for death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was the beginning, is now and shall be, world without end. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour for death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was the beginning, is now and shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Okay, that's all for tonight and uh, thank you so much for uh, praying with us and I would like to request to pray for us too that we'll continue uh, praying our uh, coronavirus novena for our good health and for all of us so that we can overcome this uh, crisis that we're experiencing right now. And uh, likewise, uh, we all, when we pray, we always beg for mercy and offer our hearts, offer our desire, offer our mind while praying to um, our uh, Immaculate Heart of Mary and the uh, Sacred Heart of Jesus or the Divine Mercy. So uh, once again, see you tomorrow. Be safe. Good night and bye for now. Thank mm -hmm. you.